once again this is me Fazal Shamaliwal, an EFL instructor of PELCI, Pamir English Language and Computer Institute. Today is my first video in grammar terminologies that is based upon grammar. What is grammar and how many classifications of grammar do we have? Grammar, grammar is the scientific skill of a language through which we use our language accurately and avoid ourselves from making mistakes. Why do we say grammar is a scientific skill of a language? Scientific itself means perfect, complete. You know that we have got seven basic skills in English language. Grammar, reading, writing, listening, conversation, pronunciation and vocabulary. So why grammar is known as a perfect and complete scale of a language? Because when we do know about grammar, your other skills are gonna be strengthened and attractive by the passage of time as well. Because grammar is real, got it or not? Some people say grammar is the backbone of a language. Why it is being sad? Because when we do not have the backbone, it means we are not going to be active. So that is why we say that if we do know about rules and regulations of a language, our spoken environment is going to be powerful. So some people say that grammar is the key of a language. Suppose inside this room we have got English language and the door is locked. So if you want to open the door, you must have the key for it. So the key for English language is grammar. Got it or not? If you do know about grammar very well, you are reading, writing, listening, conversation, pronunciation and vocabulary is going to be very powerful and strengthened as well. Got it or not? You know we have got two classifications of grammar. One is lower grammar, basic grammar, which is basically known as traditional grammar. It is a sort of grammar which is explained and given in different language institutions to language students. Got it or not? So, from level 1 class to advanced level 3 class, we do teach a Dino basic grammar which is known as traditional grammar. The second type is known as linguistics or literature's grammar. That is a sort of grammar which is given and explained to those people who has taken doctorate in languages. Got it or not? Doctorate is a degree which is known as advanced degree in grammars. That is why those people are usually called grammarians. Got it or not? So we have got types of linguistics and literature's grammar and those grammars are as case grammar, cognitive grammar, construction grammar, generative grammar, lexical functional grammar which is also known as uh, uh, LFG grammar or lexical functional grammar, LFG grammar, got it or not. Further we have got mental grammar, theoretical grammar and transformational grammar. These are advanced grammars that are explained in universities to MA or literature students, got it or not. So this was a basic information about grammar. In my coming video, inshallah, I'm gonna talk about me, uh, you know, basic features of English language that are very effective for fluent speaking. So if you want to become fluent in, uh, speaker and speak flawlessly, so be with me. Inshallah, my coming videos are gonna be regarding tenses, active and passive voices, direct and indirect speeches, gerundal and feratives, classes, subject verb agreement, sentence and some more features of English language. For more videos, do not forget to subscribe my YouTube channel by the name of Fazal Shamaliwal and thank you so much for having me and I wish you always be prosperous and successful. That's it. Thank you.